Hey everyone, this is iCamera and I here, and today I'm bringing you some more Black Ops 2 zombie information, talking about Die Rise, the new zombie map that is coming with the new Black Ops 2 DLC, it's soon to be released on January 29th, and be expecting a new trailer anytime this week, guys. So sit back, tune in, and relax, because I'm going to give you a lot of information in today's video. So guys, I want you all to take this with a grain of salt, because this is, of course, leaked information. There's no way confirming if it's true or real in any such way, because the game simply has not been released to the public yet but guys I will not be posting any screenshots of what we get on here because I don't want to be getting a strike on my channel so if you want to see all the screenshots where I actually have some footage of die rise where you can see some buildings the ray gun pack a punch the huge skyline of the city and all bunch of LMGs and new perks be sure to hit me up on Twitter it'll be sent into my Twitter in the description down below guys if you just click the Twitter they'll all be down there probably there'll be the latest tweets up there so be sure to check them out and leave some feedback in the comments down below if you leave these pictures to be real or fake for some reason everybody who leaks black ops 2 stuff doesn't really seem to have a good mic kind of weird don't you think guys now guys, Die Rise, or how some people are pronouncing D Rise, will be similar to Transit, and what I mean here is going to be four large sections in the map, or you could just play it similar to Transit, where it's just one giant map and you can go around. You can play in all these kind of different areas, except for the fog area, which is obviously going to piss off all the players who are hardcore zombie fans who hate the damn fog, Treyarch. We don't like fog in zombie maps. We don't like it. We don't like to be crowded in fog and don't know where the hell we're going. Why can't we just have a clear map? like why can't we have Varuk? why can't we have Doris? come on Treyarch but let's get back to the topic on hand guys so the four main areas of the Black Ops 2 zombie die rise map are listed as the following city obviously the title is pretty self-explanatory right there it is a city we got large buildings surrounded by a huge road obviously you're going to assume around the, that's going to be the dead center of the map next we got village it's pretty much a simple village area kind of like farm i guess you could say in the original transit map you know a couple buildings here and there got a little walkway and everything some tractors in the way not a really expensive rural, a living area just a rural place where you can probably see some little farm area here and there now this is a nuclear plant this is what i kind of interesting as you might guess the main point of interest here is power so i imagine this is where some a lot of the easter eggs will be taking place a lot of clues are gonna be held over for us cool area i imagine and then we got a railroad station this is a small train train station and consistent of the buildings and the train and the boarding platforms here we find a small stamina up and tombstone and a box location they're all going to be spread out perks like crazy which isn't really that much fun but uh i guess Treyarch just likes to screw us all the hardcore zombie players so guys we're going to be replacing the zombie bus with a wagon which is kind of weird hopefully the wagon isn't as slow as it's sounding to be i don't know what the hell is going to be controlling this and we're going to see ted returning or they're going to be like horses pulling this wagon it's all interesting crazy stuff guys but let's quickly move on to achievements so our first achievement is i can now see clearly clear all the fog and die rise which is probably a best achievement you could possibly put in a zombie map Treyarch thank you but it's probably gonna have to do some of the Easter eggs so it's probably gonna be really difficult to get our next achievement is don't rock the boat which is pretty much like this don't get the wagon damaged without doing the whole entire cycle so pretty much going from a point all the way around back to a point without getting the wagon damaged that seems like a pretty tense challenge right there Treyarch it's going a little crazy don't you think now guys our next achievement here is kill a zombie with the black cat so if you guys remember the hacking device from moon it was pretty difficult to use you could use stuff to transfer points over here and there but it was a pretty unique device always to zombies but now they're asking to kill a zombie with it something we've never actually done before and let me know what you think about that guys in the comments down below but i'm saving the best achievement for the last so check this one out now this team is called where it all started guys find the factory the giant in the map holy crap guys could Doris be an easter egg in the new die rise transit mode zombie map if you guys are hardcore zombie fans you have definitely played Doris back in world at war the best map by far in call of duty it's a crazy map and there'll be crazy throwback history to all you hardcore zombie fans so guys that brings us all the information today that i have about black ops 2 die rise zombie transit map that's a mouthful right there guys but if you're new to the channel please click the subscribe button by joining the saiyan army don't forget to leave a comment down below telling me your opinions of all this information don't forget to click on that twitter to see all the pictures released and don't forget guys to leave a like button and can we get about 800,000 likes i don't see why we can't do that guys hopefully enjoy this is i camera and i signing out everyone peace